Hey there, y'all. <laughs> Big Bear Ron here, and I know I've been on kind of a roll here today. Uh, just things on my mind, you know, uh, as they come up, and uh, I don't know in the next few days, you know, how much time I'm going to have, and you know, I'm going through some changes here, so uh, forgive me if I'm overwhelming anybody and taking up all the subscription spaces. <laughs> anyway, um. I want to extend a hearty thanks to every one of you who has been generous with your moral support, even those who have had some criticism, that's okay too. Um, I want to let you all know that, you know, I've talked with my mom about all of this and uh, don't worry, Rita is going to be just fine. Uh, I've already talked to my mom that if a situation comes that I might need her and if she would be willing to help me take care of Rita and she gladly said she would be happy to take care of Rita. In fact, I kind of think she wants Rita for her own. <laughs> anyway, um, yes, and mom and dad have both offered, you know, uh, and of course, we're talking about uh, a long time from now, you know, long-range plans. They've offered to sell me a piece of their property should I decide that I might want to sell out here, just, you know, pack up and move on. So that is an option. I mean, I'm trying to think of everything right now while I've got the time to do it to uh, reflect. Uh, yeah. So... Uh, and let me just throw at you one more time. Uh, I still have my teaching certificate. That is good in the state of Georgia. <laughs> and I don't know whether I want to teach again or not. Time will tell. And uh, we'll just have to wait and see. But right now, uh, I don't want anyone feeling sad or anything like that. Uh, I'm not going to be doing that. To me, okay, it's just simply time to move on and uh, I'm going to just simply muster up whatever I must do in order to you know transition and uh, do what I have to do okay <laughs> so um, just hang in there with me later on I'm thinking about doing some videos a video or two or three or four just about my own reflections about my years in teaching now that I'm on the outside again after having been on the inside for a dozen years. Might be interesting if we had several former teachers who might be willing to speak up. And, uh, you know, all careers are like that, you know. You have the people on the outside looking in, and then you have those on the inside looking out, and then, you know, how that goes. So, I'm not wanting to get into a mudslinging kind of thing. However, I do really think there are some real problems. Yeah. Uh, in the school systems. Mm -hmm. Now, I can only speak of my experience here in the Atlanta area. And, <laughs> you know, Anyway, we'll see how that goes, and uh, when I'll do that, I'm not sure. But uh, I tell you, I've been there for a while, and sometimes it's a it's a scary sight. <laughs> All right. So anyway, just mainly to let you know, Rita is going to be okay, and uh, you know, to me, we make our lives. You know, we have our lifetime to. Fill it up with all the joy and happiness and to put together whatever we can for our own benefit. And uh, my values haven't changed. Uh, you know, we'll just see how it goes, okay? Thanks a lot, everybody. Oh, and one more thing. <laughs> my plans for going to the Philippines for Christmas are still intact. I have the reservations bought and paid for. So, uh, 
you know, as far as I can tell, I talked with the trucking school people, what they thought about that, and they said it probably uh, shouldn't interfere. So uh, I'm going to the Philippines for Christmas, and just to be with Dante for a couple of weeks. And of course, I'll be uh, letting you know all about that. Okay. <laughs> See ya. <laughs>